What's up guys, Lo5 here. I get a lot of questions about my controller display on my stream, so I'm going to go ahead and tell you how to put it on there real quick. It's really easy. I'm recording using OBS so you can't follow my steps exactly, but it's straightforward, so bear with me. First thing I'm going to do is come over here to the OBS Project website and install CLR Browser Plugin for whichever version of OBS you're using. I'm using the 32-bit, so I'm going to take this and extract it here. Using 64-bit, take this one and extract it here. I've already got it downloaded, so I'm going to come over here, open the folder, then go to my C drive, my 32-bit program files, OBS, plugins, and then I'm just going to highlight this and drag it in there. I've already got it, so I'm not actually going to replace the files. You can see them here and here. Now you're going to launch OBS. Go to whatever scene you want the controller in, right click, add, and you should have CLR browser here now. I'm going to go ahead and click that and name it Low5 is awesome. This is going to be my controller display. So here in the URL, this is where you're going to plug in the controller display. It's, it's really, really easy. Don't worry. Uh, now come over here to the Gamepad Display website by Mr. McPoned and come down here to the example and just copy this and paste it in there. Now this P2 means it's player two. I'm using player one on my Xbox controller. So I'm gonna go and replace that with a one. This two uh, determines which kind of controller it displays. So even though I'm using an Xbox 360 controller, I can output it as whatever I want as long as he's provided it. So I want an Xbox One controller. So if I come over here to the style numbers, I'm gonna make it a one. Now, I'm just gonna push a button. I'm just gonna go ahead and push A on my controller. Now I've got a controller on the screen. It's that easy. If you want uh, any other kind of controller, I bring it where you can see it. Um, for example, let's say I'm playing, I don't know, Super Mario. I'll make that a three. Now my Xbox controller is a SNES controller. You can make that a PlayStation 4 controller, 360, PlayStation 3. I would say whatever, but there's only two options left. But that's it. It's that easy. Now you're ready to stream with the gamepad display, so go crazy. Links for both of these websites are down below. If you got any more questions, go ahead and ask. Um, but that should have you covered. Take it easy, guys. Until next time.